All right, what's up, guys? Brother Trezor here. Today, I got you guys a brand new video of another weapon in Black Ops 3. The weapon goes by the name of the Pharaoh. The Pharaoh, let me read you guys the description, okay? Four round auto burst, submachine gun, reliable damage and accuracy, cycle burst automatically by holding the trigger. I don't know what that means. Well, I do, but let me translate it for you guys. This gun can melt in one burst. All it takes is one burst at close ranges. When you get a little farther away, it can take a couple bursts, maybe one or two. Possibly three, depends how good your aim is. But this Pharaoh, I think it's on the tier one of some machine guns with the Vesper and the VMP. I have not used the Pharaoh with rapid fire. Unfortunately, I have not gotten that far with my weapon. Now you guys will be seeing gameplay of me playing on Nuketown with the Pharaoh. A small map, small quarters, so that is what the Pharaoh will propel in it. You guys can also see what perks I am using. I am using Afterburner, Fast Hands, Gun Ho, and Blast Suppressor. I suggest picking perks that are going to make you more quick, more silent, because they're going to be in people's faces. They're going to be spraying that burst weapon, and you guys want to have dead silence, want to have all that. But as always, it's your preference. You guys can choose whatever perks you guys want. I'm here to talk about the gun. So let's talk a little bit more about the gun. The damage, you guys already know, it can melt you in one burst. The range, the range... I don't know, it's a little on either side, it can go either way. It can, it's pretty good, it's a burst weapon, so you're going to get pretty good ranges. You're going to burst that gun, get some good far distance kills. At close ranges, it can also kill people, because it's a submachine gun. So it's a little iffy, so it's, it's alright. Fire rate, it's a burst weapon. Apparently you can hold down the trigger, I'm not sure about that, I haven't tried that. Accuracy, it's a burst weapon. Good accuracy. So this barrel, from the description, it was born to be OP. And it's pretty OP. As you guys can see, I'm getting all those nice kills and getting those nice bursts. Couple one bursts. But speaking of it being a burst weapon, that is what separates it from the other tier 1 submachine guns. In the other tier 1 category, you have the VMP and the Vesper. Those can get out of hand. They're kind of like the Scorpion. They can get a little wild. And that's where the Feral comes in. You can burst that weapon and you can get some nice kills, you can control your recoil more easier, more easily than if you were using the Vesper. The Vesper, that is a really, that, that's a scorpion basically. The VMP, it's more of a MSMC with a little bit more recoil, but the Feral, the Feral, it reminds me of, the, the, what's it called, the Chickum or the Chickum, whatever you guys want to call it. It reminds me of that, but a little bit faster fire rate, which is what I think the Chickum or Chickum needed. In order to be a tier one submachine gun black ops one or two my bad but the pharaoh it's always it's your choice it's your choice in black ops 3 all the guns are pretty good they're all decent except for a couple but there are a lot of good weapons in black ops 3 so go try out the pharaoh i think it's a really good weapon but i'm not you guys go try it out boys triple the chooser i'm out peace